Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Daniel here with the Cascade Card Wranglers, and today we will be bringing you Zendikar Rising Box, Collector Box, number three. Welcome back, everyone. It's good to see everyone. Um, before we get started, I just want to thank each and every one of you for uh, coming and checking out the video. It means a lot to us here. If you like what we do on here on this channel at the Cascade Card Wranglers, please feel free to hit the like button below and be sure to subscribe to get the latest and greatest videos as soon as we put them out. Now, without further ado, let's get to talking everything Collector Box Zendikar Rising. Um... So, box number three here. Again, prices are still plummet, not plummeting, but still going down. And uh, I don't see an ending here, guys. I really don't. Um, not yet, at least. Uh, it seems that... I'm not sure what's going on. I mean, the Expeditions are holding their uh, their own, obviously. But uh, the, the actual cards in the set, I don't know if they're being undermined by the Expeditions and by the Chase... For the foil ones, but um, not many cards are above like forty or thirty dollars. Um, as always, we'll be opening this. We'll open one of them in the middle this time, and one of them in the end, just to like stir it up, mix it up. You know, don't want to keep uh, doing the same thing over and over and over again. But we got twelve packs, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful, beautiful uh, Zendikar Rising. Uh, Art of Omnath over here with his four arms. Here we go, MTG Gods. Wish us luck um, and give us the cards we want. So, uh, I hope everyone's enjoying their product. Um, I hate to say it, but Wizards still has a lot of delays and problems happening right now with their product. We're going to go a little faster here. We're not going to necessarily look at the commons here. We'll go one by one, one or two packs, and just highlight some of the art here. But uh, uh, Vast Wood Fortification for the modal DFC Vast Wood Thicket. Um, but I do want to go a little faster now that we have a better... Um, Understanding of what the set is, we've seen the commons and uncommons, but this is a new one. The first extended art non-foil is Tajuru Paragon. I haven't cracked that guy yet. Uh, crack Plate Baleth will be our regular rare. We have our two showcase cards, Dreadworm and... Woo, sorry about that, guys. And Canyon Jerboa. And we have another Valakut Exploration. This card seems to be very, very easy to get. I've gotten like four or five of these already in three boxes. Um, showcase or not. We have our Akum Hellhound Foil Showcase. Common or Uncommon. And ending on a Kragma Skyclave Ravager um, Box Topper. I got the non-foil last time. Um, or last box. Uh, Angel Warrior and Insect Token. So, pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. Haven't gotten these uh, foil variants yet. Which is pretty nice. Pack 1 was okay. All right, let's get through the commons here. We've got, I'll try and highlight the modal DFC. Skyclave Cleric turns into Skyclave Basilica. I think that these modal DFCs are brilliant, but again, not gaining much traction yet. I think it's because the meta has not settled yet from the rotation. I think people are trying to figure out what's going on with the bands that just happened. So I'll give it another couple weeks and we'll see what goes up and what goes down. Crawling Baron's Extended Art Non-Foil. We got Myriad Construct for the dollar or two rare. We've got the Canopy Baleth, the McKinney Ox, and a rare, the Kazandu Mammoth. This is another rare modal DFC um, that is very easy to get so far. I've gotten a ton of these from these collectors. Skyclave Pickaxe into the rare soul shatter um uh, extended box art extended art foil box topper sorry uh that's cool i haven't gotten one of these in foil uh cat and a goblin construct moving along here hopefully we can hit two expeditions today ladies and gentlemen because we only got one last time um and it wasn't the best one that makes up for the first box where we hit a Misty Rainforest in a Cavern of Souls. So, there you go. The volatility on these, right? Our full art is another mountain. 
very nice and a maddening cacophony uh, this usually happens when Daniel is fed up with the dogs and doesn't know what to do because he has a conference call in five minutes so um and for our next hit linvala shield of seagate very nice linvala now in two colors azorius colors uh there was some speculation on this card i'm not sure where this stands yet but nonetheless it's the first time i'm pulling it so i'm happy uh canopy bailiff dreadworm and we have our first pathway non foil uh needle verge pathway Another pathway that I've been getting a ton of in these collector boxes, um, Ruin Crab for the foil, common or uncommon card in this case, and our rare, the Orin Reef Ooze for the not so uh, extended art box stopper. I'm not sure how much the extended art is. I can't imagine too much as the Orin Reef Rare is very little in its normal version. Illusion and copy for our token. And moving on to the next pack here, um, no mythics as of, as of yet, unless again I've missed some because I missed one last time. But uh, we're gonna go anti cognition. Yeah, we're gonna go fast on these guys. I always want to look at every card's art, and it's hard to uh, find that balance between time and um, appreciating the art of the set. Uh, but we've seen a bunch of these, so let's move on. Our first non-extended or extended art non-foil is Nighthawk Scavenger, followed by our first Mythic Fury of Akum, Morag Fury of Akum. Very nice. Mythic number one, Spitfire Lagak, Skyclave Pickaxe into a Lotus Cobra Showcase non-foil here. Got plenty of those, and whoa, we just. Uh, we just did an oopsie there, ladies and gentlemen. We saw that there was an expedition there. I think it's a ancient tomb or a strip mine. I don't, I didn't see it too well, but let's see what we got here. We've got the strip mine. Ooh, ooh, that is not good, guys. Is that part of the art, or is that damage? <laughs> I really thought that this was part of the art, guys. Wow. I thought, or I just thought that this part of the art was damage. Needless to say, strip mine foil, upper mid range, first expedition, very nice. Um, now that we're recovering from that heart attack there, Angel Warrior and Goblin Concha. Um, I'll take that one. I haven't gotten that one yet. I think strip mine is, this, is in the 50s, maybe? Um, I don't remember, don't quote me on that, but let's do this, one, two, three, four, five, commons, you'll have your two uncommons, got another swampy, and our first, um, our first extended art non-foil is a no one, the Ruin Thief, I think he's a commander for the, um, the commander decks. So I got Oboon last time, so Mythic number three. Uh, Aura Skyclave Hierophant, the non-box, buy a box promo. This is the regular one, very nice. We're gonna go with Dress Territorial Scythe Cat, Brushfire Elemental into Scoot Swarm, the card that annoys everyone on Arena with that landfall mechanic. And the next common showcase or uncommon showcase uh, foil card will be the Dreadworm, followed by land the crag crown pathway again getting a ton of these i have a ton of these in foil i've not hit many other foils um but i've been getting crag crown and needle verge and uh lava glide river glide pathways um so there's certain pathways that are just way more common uh than than others I'm starting to notice here. Moving on, although it's only box number three, these all these three boxes have gone from different sources though in different parts of the country. So that goes to tell you. Um, how uh, sorry, I lost my train of thought there. How uh, how rare some of these uh, <coughs> cards are to pull. Ball again, recovery. 
sanctuary. Very nice. Island. And our first, uh, or no, our fourth mythic and our first uh, extended art non-foil is Turn Timber Symbiosis. I've gotten the foil version and the non-foil version already in the first box. Um, glass Pool Mimic for the Modal EFC Glass Pool Shore. Into the Zandu Nectar Pot and Akum Hellhound. We've got a rare. The River Glide Pathway. There, what I just tell you, I just called this card out. The Lava Glide and River Glide Pathways. It's all the pathways I have. Like, literally. It's pretty insane. And our last uh, card here is going to be the Magmatic Chandler. Um, not a lot of money into this one, but still a pretty cool card. I don't know if I have the foil version. So, <clears throat> that works. Cat and Hydra. Alright, coming on half a box left, I believe. Um, hopefully, we get A, another expedition, and B, um, we'll get more mythics out of this box from the last opening. So, commons, uncommons, very nice. Planes, very cool planes. And our first Rare, Skyclave Relic, followed by Cherix the Raging Isle, the jankiest of jank, <laughs> Zero 017 Crab, very nice, Prowling Felidar, into Ruin Crab, and our next rare is the Crag Crown Pathway, again guys, uh, I'm telling you, I only have these cards, it's crazy, it's crazy, I feel like I shouldn't even be showing the back anymore of this. Akuma Hellhound into a mythic Sea Gate Stormcaller. Last I looked, I think this held some money to it. Um, hopefully I'll be putting the prices up here, but uh, but uh, I, I do believe that this is a, um, off the top of my head, one of the more expensive box toppers. Very nice. Core Warrior and a plant. Alright, let's open our first of two. Just do a little randomization here. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see what we got here. A little bit after the halfway point, but that's okay. <clears throat> All right. And our first expedition, non-foil expedition box topper is, holy hell, Sea of Clouds. Um, we pulled this in the last in the last box, and it's one of the least valuable so there goes there's that dud and let's continue opening some more uh collector booster box or booster packs five spike field hazard have i seen this modal dfc yet spike field cave maybe maybe not not one that i remember too well i love this whirlpool and or Skyclave Fire Fan. This is the buy box promo, but without the foil. We have Magmatic Channeler, Zandu Nectar Pot, Skyclave Squid into the rare Clear Water Pathway. Well, there's there's another pathway, <clears throat> and Merc Water Pathway. I think we've gotten this as well. Prowling Felidar into a Mythic. This is an expedition. Mr. Burley, what do we have? The Marsh Flats, ladies and gentlemen. Heck yeah. Ding, ding, ding. We've got ourselves a fetch land. Very, very nice. Very, very nice. And the Orzov choice of colors. I'll take it. So there's our two. <clears throat> Drake and Plant. There's our two. All right. So goal number one accomplished. Don't get hosed on expeditions. I'll take it. The foil expeditions, we definitely made some money. Ooh, I like this blade. Very nice. I know it's common, but I just haven't seen it. Rune Crab. Very nice planes into Relic Robber. And a clear water halfway uh, foil. This is the regular pack 
uh, card Murkwater Pathway. Just pulled the borderless version. Prowling Felidar. Fearless Fledgling into a Mythic. Another Omnath. All right, we'll take it. Another Omnath. It's non-foil again, the showcase. It's about 20 bucks as of a couple days ago. But um, nonetheless, we're not complaining today. This is great. Spitfire Lagok into Linvala Shield of Seagate. Very nice. Um, we haven't gotten the extended art. And we pulled the pack foil, I believe, this time. But very cool to have the uh, extended art foil. That'll fetch some money, I believe. Um, and again, I'll put prices up on anything $5 and over. Because we want to make a profit here on the Cascade Card Wranglers. All right, going through our uncommons. There's another modal DFC. Forced squad commander, squad commander for the duplication. Wow. Our two showcase. Um, Coming on Cummins, Territorial Scythe Cat, and McKinney Ox into another mythic. Jace, Mirror Mage. Wow, I pulled uh, three of these already, so <laughs> that's nice. I'll take the Mythic, though. I guess that's why they're not very expensive. Skyclave Squid into Verizal, the Split Current. I haven't seen this guy. Nice. Don't know how much money he's, don't know how good he is, don't know how much money he's got. Again, haven't played in a little bit just because, um have a lot going on in life right now like we all do <clears throat> because of this wonderful wonderful year that's happened but um one, two, three four five commons but uh we're chugging along here we're doing our best we can right and we're just staying positive uh sign of the swarm saloon division into saloon the isle for our modal dfc forest into mall of the skyclaves non-foil extended art very nice next rare is ooh, this feels thicker interesting this card actually feels thicker than the other cards interesting now here he's lithoforming into spitfire lagak skyclave squid next rare is bylath world sculptor already pulled him into a common Kazanu Nectar Pot and a rare Archpriest of Iona. Very nice. With a Cat Beast and an Insect Token. And finally, ladies and gentlemen, our last pack. As we say, last pack magic, baby. Um, may we get the best card in the set here. We'll see. All right, uncommons. Vastwood Fortification into Vastwood Thicket. We already saw that in the beginning. Mountain. Description of Ruin. Non-foil descended. Zareth. Sand. The Trickster. Very nice. Into our Skyclave Squid. Skyclave Geopede. And our Pathway. Bright Climb Pathway. Along with Grim Climb Pathway. Kindy Ox into our last card. It's an expedition, I believe. Or no, it's not an expedition. I thought I thought it said EX. Yeah, sorry. Uh, Coral Helm Chronicler. Wow, I got too uh, I got too excited there. Nonetheless, nice box hopper and an Angel Warrior. Very nice. Okay, well, I'm not gonna lie, unless I missed any. Um, better box than we did last time. I mean, we got two expeditions and just from the box, the foil ones. And uh, we've got what looks like nine mythics, if I didn't miss any of um, the mythics over there. So let's open this last box, this last box topper here real quickly before we end the video and see what we got. Last chance at a good pool. <laughs> oh, get out of here. Okay, guys, um, go to the previous video and check the ending. 
these are the exact two pools and I got these from different sources. Wow. Well, can't be too mad again. We got those two foil uh, expeditions there. Um, <laughs> it's just funny that we pulled the exact same box toppers as the last time. Daniel here with the Cascade Kind Wranglers signing off. You guys have a great rest of your week and we'll see you soon.